Hello, I'm Amy Kristen, Global Vice President, Networking Academy. Thank you for taking a moment to hear about research commissioned by the Networking Academy around the ICT gender gap. Women are proportionally underrepresented in the technology sector, both in education and in the workplace. In Europe, where our research was done, the uptake of female students in ICT-based programs is only 9%. Findings show that many women do, who do well in education still do not pursue ICT jobs, due largely to their negative perceptions of ICT careers. Within the Networking Academy globally, we fare slightly better, with female participation of about 19 percent. However, women are still outnumbered by men at a ratio of more than 4 to 1. I believe this is a no-win situation. The lack of women in the tech sector represents a loss of talent for industry and a loss of opportunity for females entering the job market. And this is a pattern that is set to continue if more is not done to educate, support, and encourage women, girls, and their role models. Within the Networking Academy, there are a number of things we are doing to support girls in our courses and to encourage, encourage them to consider the true benefits of an ICT career. We work with groups such as the Cisco Women's Action Network to create events for female students and allow them to meet female ICT role models. We have girls-only competitions to build their confidence in their capabilities. And we cooperate with the EU to run shadow days where young women are invited to Cisco offices to see what the real world of ICT is like. There is more we can do. Parents, educators, the public and private sectors we all have a role in the, to play in changing perceptions about the industry. By giving girls access to more realistic and authentic information about ICT and ICT careers, we can help open their minds to the worlds of opportunity that are out there for them. Please take the time to read through our white paper and its findings and recommendations, and get involved with changing perceptions today. Thank you.